guys, it's Megan. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this DIY pop socket. And if you guys don't know what a pop socket is, it is a thing that mainly musers use, like people that make Musical.ly's, and they use it to kind of like hold their phone and like their Musical.ly's kind of like smoother. It's just this little thing that you attach to your phone, and you can also use it as like a phone stand. I'm gonna show you all the ways that you can use it at the end of this video. Before you like go and comment like, oh, they're only $10, like, yeah, I know, but I just thought this was a fun DIY way to make your own, and you can definitely customize this, and it's definitely cheaper than $10. You could get, like, 20 of these for, like, $6 on Amazon. I feel like a professional muser now. Like, you guys want to follow me on Musical.ly? It's right here. Learn how to make this DIY pop socket, then just keep on watching. For this project, you will need two 1 and 3 4 inch suction cups, super glue, cardstock paper or scrapbook paper, clear tape or packing tape, and scissors. So the first thing you need to do is remove the hooks from your suction cups if they came with any. Then you'll want to take your super glue and glue both of the suction cups together. So now I just searched Tumblr Circle PNG and I'm just gonna go to images and just look for one that I like. And I actually really like this one, so I will just drag that to my desktop. Then I'm going to go into a Word document, and I already made one, and it's the Musical.ly symbol because I am making a Musical.ly about how to make this, and so you guys should follow me on Musical.ly. So you're just going to drag that in to your Word document, then you're going to click on it, format picture, and then you're going to click crop, and then you're going to crop it to as close to your image as possible. Okay, and then you're just going to decrease the size and you want to make it 1.75 by 1.75. And so then you're just going to want to print out your image onto some cardstock paper. And so then you're just going to want to cut out your image and you're going to want to cover both sides with some clear tape. And so then I took my suction cups that I glued together and I cut the little tab thing off of the top one but I left it on the bottom one just so that it would be easier to kind of like take off of your phone. And so then I just took some super glue and I glued my image thing onto the top one which is the one that I just cut the little thing off. Um, hopefully that makes sense. Hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing. And once the glue dries, your DIY pop socket is ready to use. The first way to use your DIY pop socket is to make a music leap. The second way to use your DIY pop socket is to take better selfies. You can do it like at an angle. Let's be real, you can't just take a selfie like this. I think for selfies, it's probably better to put it on the bottom of your phone. Not gonna be a struggle to like get to the little button down there. So the third way you can use your DIY pop socket is you can use it as a phone stand for watching YouTube or Netflix. And the fourth way to use your DIY pop socket is to Use it as a tripod for making music, please. The fifth way to use your pop socket is to use it as a charging stand. You can also use it to shorten headphones. And you can use it to store headphones as well. So I really hope that you guys liked that video. I hope that you found it helpful. And if you guys make this, definitely send me a picture with it. And I actually just created my own hashtag. It's DIY with MW. And the reason I made it that was because I searched it on Instagram and there was nothing, no post. So I was just like, that's mine. Honestly, I'm so happy with how this DIY came out. If you're not already, and you'd like to be, make sure to subscribe for more videos just like this one. Make sure to follow me on Musical.ly, obviously, it's at WellerMegs. And also make sure to follow me on my Instagram, it's at MeganWeller97. And make sure to enter my back to school giveaway, it's going on until September 1st, 2016. So thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!